this is Sarah Michelle with a networking nugget. Holidays are a great time to take advantage of expanding your network and improving your net worth, your social capital. Here's five quick tips to help you expand and improve your network. Number one, never leave home without business cards. If you're going to a holiday party, make sure you have either in your purse or a pocket in your pair of pants, stick a dozen business cards and also a pen. The reason why you want a pen is because most likely other people will not have brought business cards. And so you can then write down their information uh, on your card. You can also be the resource for the party. Everyone, I saw this recently, flocked to a gentleman who had business cards and also a pen. So they were borrowing his cards and his pen and writing down other people's contact information. And by the way, they had this gentleman's card in their pocket. So don't leave home without business cards and a pen. Number two, also don't leave home without your intention. What do you hope is going to happen at this party or open house or office party you're attending? What, how could you be a resource, resource for somebody at this party? And how could somebody at this open house or party be a resource to you? What do you want to have happen? Think about that. Put your intentions out there. And think about the skills and the talents or information you might have, an experience you recently went through that might be valuable to somebody there at the party. Promise you, if you put those intentions out, the opportunities are going to appear. Number three, think about some open-ended questions that you can ask at parties, especially with people that you don't know, that will get the conversation going. Things that might have to do with your community you're in, local news happening. It might be uh, about what they might do and what you do or opportunities or who do you know, what brought you here to the party? Who, who, how do you know the people that are hosting this party? Great opener to just get some information flowing. Open-ended questions that start with who, what, how, when, why. If you ask a sentence, if you, a sentence starts with any of those five words, the person can't answer yes or no. And of course, you're listening for how you might be a resource for them. The next thing you need to, another tip I want to tell you about is you need to realize a lot of times during the holiday season is a great time to get into people you want to network with. Some network, uh, some folks that you're trying to, to get an introduction to because if they're working, most likely their meetings have been canceled because of everybody being on vacation and uh, they postponed having uh, uh, lots of things filled on their calendar because most of the team or parts of the team are already on vacation. So don't, don't forget about that. A lot of times it's easy to get into people during this time that are most likely not easy to get into outside the holiday season. So ask for some of those meetings now if people are actually scheduled in the office. And last but not least, follow up. Follow up with people you meet at these parties. Bring those business cards back, those names you've written down. Follow up with either a handwritten note, a thank you card, a phone call, an email, any of those ways to let the person know how much you appreciated meeting them, maybe the information data they shared, and let them know how you're following up and some of the advice or tips or connections that they made for you. So connect the dots during the holidays. It's a great time to take advantage of this. People are in the giving spirit. Great time to expand your network. Happy Holidays.